Welcome to Prayer and Coffee. In John thirteen three, Jesus, knowing that the Father had given all things into his hands and that he had come from God and was going to God, Jesus knew who he was. He knew what the Father had given him, and he knew his ministry that he had from his Father, where he was going. And the Lord wants to help you realize who you are and what you are graced and gifted and called to do. Ephesians 2, 8 and 9 speaks about our salvation by grace through faith. But then in verse 10, we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepared beforehand that we should walk in them. He has created us brand new in Christ Jesus so we can do the things he planned for each of us. And he knows what he has gifted and called each of us to be. We are here for such a time as this. In Jeremiah 29, verses 11 and 13, For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord, thoughts of e peace and not of evil, to give you a future and a hope. And you will seek me and find me when you search for me with all your heart. God knows who you are, who he created you to be in Christ Jesus, and he what he created you to do for right now. Seek him, and he will show you. Let's pray. Father, so many don't know their real identity. They don't know what other... They know what others have told them, and they know what society is telling them, but they don't know who you told them. Jesus, we need you, our commander, to lead your people into their rightful place in the body of Christ, your ecclesia. Holy Spirit, draw the children of God into the last day church. Give them a hunger for the truth of who they are in Jesus. Draw them to the word of God, to the place of prayer, to the place of seeking after you, Lord, and till they find out who they were created in Christ to be. Let us know, each of us, our spiritual gifts and our place and our calling in the body of Christ. Let each of us be ready for the last, this last day, church. Fill our hearts with your love so that we can love the lost and using our gifts and callings, bring them into your house. And Lord, we pray for our nation, and we ask that you save America. In Jesus' name, amen.